Hello and welcome to my tutorial on how to write, how to make VB encrypt a string and then write it to a text file. Okay, make a Windows form application. Then we've got to add a button and a text box. So that. And then a button which is here. Just a bit smaller. Make it encrypt and just the form size. All right, so the coding part is we got to define the file. Right, hang on, I'll go over this once I'm done. Let's move sys system dot io dot streamwriter. See, we'll go with something. Actually, let's spell it right. Something dot txt. Close that. So that's what that line should look like. Dim. Okay, so dim is the defined thing. Oh, you should know this before starting this tutorial. That's you should know the basics before starting this tutorial. That's the name of it. You can make that whatever the hell you please. Um, and, oops, forgot that. It's going to be as new. All right. So, and that's basically the system IO streamwriter. And that's what it's going to save it as. You need this to write to a file. All right. Then we're going to define um, A. Let's define A, B, and C as strings. And then define outcome as string, and that's all the strings you need, I think. Yep. So now we need to go a equals equals a. Same with b and c. Oops. B doesn't equal c. C equals c. And so they're the strings we want it to replace with. We want a to be replaced, B to be replaced, C to be replaced. That's how encryption works. Alright, so out, now we've got to do the outcome string. So the outcome, which, which equals text box one dot text. Oops. Text. So that's the text box we put in our form here. That's the text box there. And now we've got to actually write the encryption code. So outcome, which will equal replace. So now we want to replace that with that. Now we want to it to replace the string. If it finds A in the string, it will place replace A with 1. And you do that with A, B, and C. So we've got A, B, C. And it's replace these. You can also change this, whatever you want. Which would, but if you change these, you have to change these and these. And, yeah. And if you can change that as well. But you have to change this, that, 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 that. So let's make that 2 and 3. Okay, so it changes A to 1, B to 2, and C to 3. Now, we'll write it to a um, file which is easy with Visual Basics 2008. It's much easier than VB6. So I recommend, really recommend getting Visual Basics 2008 if you're using programs to write to files and everything. So we go file.write and the string we want to write, which is outcome, because this is a string that's been modified a bit here. And then we have to close the file, which will close the file so we don't get any errors. Alright, let's test it. So we want to encrypt A, B, C, A, B, C. And it should come out as 1, 2, 3, space, 1, space, 2, space, 3. So encrypt. Alright, so that to a string. Let's go to local disk C. There's a text file there. And 
See, one, two, three, space, one, two, three, whatever, blah, blah, blah. All right, so that's easy. You can also, also do that to any other thing. Example, oops. Example, let's add a, another word in there. So if we'll go dim, we'll go YouTube, YouTube as stream. And we'll make YouTube equal YouTube and we'll make it replace YouTube with well probably let's make it replace with tube you yep all right now let's go ABC ABC YouTube YouTube encrypt all right, it's encrypted. Now we can go back to local DC, go back to the text document. It's um, put a two there because YouTube's got a B in it there. I knew that was gonna happen. And yeah, so that's my tutorial. Hope you find it interesting. Um, stay tuned for my next tutorial on how to unencrypt this text. See ya.